What's up guys? How we doing? Welcome to the video. My name is John, spelled like Gene. We go over this every time. We got a cool video. We got a fun video. We got a video that you guys have been asking for, which is an update video. Um, I'm gonna kinda update you a little bit on my life. Sam's gonna update you on her life. A lot of updates, a lot of stuff. And I haven't been able to film as much, so it's been frustrating. Cause it's like a hobby, it's something I enjoy doing. So that's what we're gonna be doing. We're gonna be updating you, we're gonna be telling you what's going on, we're gonna be walking into buildings and making the exposure all messed up. It's a good time. Okay, so the first thing I wanna talk about, the first update, um, Kind of exciting. Uh, the last competition I did was the Reindeer Games. I'm actually going to be doing another competition. It's going to be April 21st through the 22nd. Yeah, it's a two-day comp. Later this month, um, it's called the Spring Games, for, uh, hosted by Fortius. I'm really excited about it. I'm nervous. I mean, it's definitely a step up above Reindeer Games. Reindeer Games was like, I was on the floor for like 10 minutes max within all three or four events. This one is two days and there's a lot longer, grueling workout. So, if you want to come by, if you want to support me and the team I'll be on, um, April 21st, CrossFit 40 you can look up Spring Games on Facebook, and I'll have all the information there. I'll, I'll be sure to link it down below as well. Update number one, new competition. And I'm, I'm nervous because I'm going, uh, I'm camping this month. Uh, I'm going to Disneyland this month. I've been helping Sam move. She moved this month. Um, so I haven't had a lot of time to like, really dedicate and train but um, it'll be fine I gotta trust trust the work I've been putting in update one competition That's good. so the second part is not really an update on me but it's an update just kind of on the CrossFit community and the CrossFit scene Tia Toomey won gold at the Commonwealth Games so now she's the 2017 CrossFit Games champ and she is gold medal at the Commonwealth, which is like the islands and that kind of part of the, we have the, there's like the Europeans, there's the, the USA national one and then there's that. That's kind of what I think it is. I'm not super versed on that, but good for her. Here's her winning clean and jerk. Will it be gold or silver? For Tia clear to me. She's cleaned it. Yes! What a champion! Oh, it is gold for Australia! Tia clear to me! I've got this weird relationship with Toomey because I don't have any relationship with Toomey actually. I'm not against her, but I still am not like behind her winning like that's not a big emotional thing for me for her to win if Sarah were to go I'd probably cry um, if Katrin were to go back if these other people I feel like I'm connected to them to me I just haven't really connected with I'm proud of her nonetheless and it's cool to see this CrossFit community starting to you know you're not supposed to be a master of anything but it's cool to see that her get there Okay, so we just finished the workout. Um, man, that was rough for me. First Friday workout after the open. 
Oh, uh, well, there, there actually was a Friday, but what were we doing last week? I moved. <laughs> she, you're moving. That's what we did. Um, yeah, like I said, I actually said that earlier. It's just been crazy with the moving and stuff like that. That was a humbling workout, but Sam has some things she wants to say. Yeah, so I have officially been dieting for eight weeks, and I've decided not, I'm not doing the bikini show. So it's been going really good. Um, I've lost only about like four pounds in four eight weeks, um, but it's been going really good. And then I was just going. I was like about a couple weeks ago. I, I think it was probably due to like the open and stuff and all the competitiveness and stuff too. I was like, I really am enjoying CrossFit. Like I feel like the past like, year and especially like the beginning of this year, I've been enjoying CrossFit like a lot. And I was like, wow, like I see like a lot of improvements, especially with making my diet on point. I've been improving and like my lips have been going up. I've been doing well on like Metcons. And then I was talking to my coach about it because we're doing CrossFit with like along with my bikini training, as you guys know. Um, and she was like, well, this sport, as in like bikini and competing in bikini and stuff, um, she was like, well, this sport isn't performance based. And um, it's all about like how you look. And I was like, right when she said that, like something clicked in me. And I was like, oh, okay, like that that's true, you know? And I was like, well, you know, I just don't wanna do it. And I was like, no, I think like performance-based workouts, like CrossFit and everything is more important to me than I thought. So that's where I'm at. The other day in a CrossFit workout, I got 11 muscle-ups in a workout. And I've never done that before. So I'm really excited to see how it goes. <laughs> So rewind to last competition, post competition. I didn't know like what to do at all. Like I didn't know you were supposed to reverse diet up. I was barely eating any calories and I was miserable and I hated working out. And so then I was like, oh, well I wanna do another bikini show because I've learned so much and I wanna see like how my body has changed, um, like all the muscle I put on and stuff. And then I was like thinking about it when I made the decision not to do the show and I was like, well I can still do that. I can still, cut down and you know for different reasons so I'm excited to keep moving forward and that's what I've been doing the past couple weeks still moving forward and I'm excited to see the changes that are coming I have one more thing so our little life motto is like look good feel good and I think it's like more than that now because it's like we got to eat good and that'll make you look good and make you feel good. And then whatever workout you like, whether it's CrossFit or Pilates, you know, make you feel good, right? But I think now my life motto is like, look good, feel good, perform good. Because once I got like my, I got, we've always meal prepped and everything, but like once I've like, you know, stuck to a good, not diet, like it is a diet right now, but a good diet, I'm like, oh, I'm performing better. And that all course, it's a little circle, look good, feel good, perform good. That's my new life motto. What do you think? <laughs>